The following is a fan-based parody. Mirai Nikki is property of Saikai Suno, Katakawa Shoten, Asrid, and Funimation. Please support the official release. Wow! That girl sure is crazy and scary! It's a good thing nobody like that exists in real life! I just traveled to a parallel universe and killed myself in order to take my own place! And I did it all for the sake of love! Yup, nobody like that exists at all. Oh my god, it's a piece of concrete! I have to write about this! I think today is shaping up to be a good day. Mutter, 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 Amano is a loner. Mutter, 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 he had your phone. Mutter, 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 my god, your biceps are huge. Mutter, 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 I thought we talked about this, Gary. Hey, Gusai, are you a serial killer? Are you? You win this round, Gusai. Hey, Gusai, are you a serial killer? Can't talk. Creating plot device. Go f*** yourself. I shall dye my hair with your blood. Whatever. I don't know what's creepier. The fact that she sculpted an exact replica of my imaginary friend, or the fact that she sculpted it out of dried bird crap. Hello. Speaking of crap! Your cell phone predicted that you're going to die. Come with me if you want to live. Interesting proposal. Here's my counteroffer. Running, 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 running! According to the diary, you know going to cut me off at the other end of the street! I'm cutting you off at the other end of the street! Whoa, deja vu! When we All I have to do is enjoy the nice, quiet elevator ride. You fool! You can't ride in an elevator without listening to soothing music! Luckily, I came prepared! <laughs> Your tensions go. Okay, throw a dart at him. Duh. Okay. <laughs> Just happened. I guess he couldn't live without his phone. <laughs> no. Aww. Mutter, mutter, mutter. Battle royale. Mutter, 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 winner gets my job. Mutter, 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 I want your scarf. No, my scarf! Get your own! Mutter, 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 pop and fresh, anorexic power ranger. Excuse me, the correct term is Sentai, thank you. I don't much care for cartoon porn. I'm completely boned. And I've made an internet meme! <coughs> oh no! Telemarketers! I'm selling him a vacuum cleaner, even if it kills me! Uh, you know, what do you- SHUT UP AND LET ME BE NAKED! Hello, fellow student. I am just a normal student. Like you. That sure is a big cockroach over there. Haha, <laughs> you fool! I'm not a normal student at all! I can't tell if it's alive or dead. I'm actually a terrorist! Oh wait, it's, it's alive. alive. Pay attention to me, you asshole! Oh no! Yuki's in trouble! I have to rescue him! Well? Give me a minute! Mr. Cockroach, why? Huh? Gary, did you hear that? Sounded like an explosion. The only sound I hear, Dave, is the sound of your biceps. <sighs> Pipping me the f out, Gary. We must let Yuki Teru die so that the rest of us can live. Interesting proposal. Here's my counteroffer. <laughs> Looks like your girlfriend's coming to save you. I do not know that person. I'll save you, Yuki! Shut up! Well, the culprit got away and numerous people lost their lives. But all in all, was a good day. Come on, Yuno. Let's go home.
You know, are you coming with me? Damn straight! Okay, does this bikini make my boobs look big? Would I be standing behind this tree if it didn't? Peeing in the pool is good. You know, your bikini top accidentally came off. Nope. Help me! Marshmallows! But Yuki, we just stayed. For God's sake, woman, make yourself decent. Shut up and let me be naked! Does pastel coloring make my boobs look big? Would I be sitting behind this desk if it didn't? And from that day forth, we swore we'd always be together. Forever. I wonder if a fall from this height would kill me. Oh, nature's calling. You know, which way's the bathroom? Can't hear you, Yuki. I'm peeling an apple. <laughs> Killing apples is so therapeutic. Clearly this door leads to the bathroom. Leave it to a teenage girl to be so ashamed of the smell of her own bodily functions as she try to seal it up with tape. Oh great, now the house smells. That's better! <laughs> When will my package come through the mail slot? Wanna put your package in my slot? No! Can Yuki Teru come out and play? Get your ass back out here, boy! What do you want? Get your shoes on. We're going for a road trip. Where are we going? We're going to McDonald's. And then after that, we're gonna go pay a visit to an ancient temple that's under the control of some crazy cult that dabbles in rape and mass suicide. You lost me at McDonald's. Fine, I'll make it Taco Bell. Wait, Mr. Detective, there's something very important I have to tell you. What is it, Sonny Boy? Yeah, what is it, Sonny Boy? You know has three dead bodies stashed away in her house! Yuki! You didn't think you could intimidate me just by standing there, did you? That's okay, I wasn't really listening anyway. Huh? Get in the car! A member of the FBI. That stands for Female Body Inspector. Let me inspect your body. Security! Calling me, and everywhere we go, she ends up killing someone! What should I do, Mr. Frog? Surrender! Well, that's your answer to everything! Dirty Lewis! Talk about having a frog in your throat. The Chosen One will see you now. What on earth would a cult leader want with us? 98, 99, 100. Ready or not, here I come. Where the f*** is he? I am the king of hide and seek. Hi. Oh no! Your futon is on fire! Strange, that doesn't usually happen unless I'm having sex. Hey-o! Ah, uh, but no, seriously, I'm a victim of rape. We need to get her out of there! Quick! Someone grab an axe! Got one, sir. Good thing I have life insurance! Hey, stop breaking my stuff. Do you mean the people or the furniture? Stop breaking my stuff! Let's go, Yuki! Stop breaking my stuff! F*** you! Okay, you did that last one on purpose. You're assuming the other ones are accidental? Look, you know there's the exit! We're almost there, Yuki! Wait, Yukiteru. There's something important I have to tell you. What is it, Tsubagi? I was raped. Wanna see the flashbacks? Uh, not really. It all started many years ago. God damn it! The only way to get into heaven is to commit statutory rape. Dagnabbit, Jim, hurry up! The rest of us want it heard. Hold your horses, I'm waiting for the Viagra to kick in. Ooh, there it goes. Oh, oh there I go. And that was the day I wasn't allowed to be a virgin anymore. The end. Good God, that was horrible! 
I thought this was supposed to be a parody. Who on earth would find that funny? Ha! You know! Rape isn't funny! It is when it happens to someone you don't give a shit about. Nobody's fisting Yuki but me! Soon I will blow you all to smithereens with the mighty bomb of justice. Nobody's blowing Yuki but- Shut the f*** up, you know! It's pretty serious, and we don't have the proper medicine to treat it. We need to get you to a hospital. No need, I. They say that laughter is the best medicine, and nothing would make me laugh more right now than watching Yuno get raped. But rape isn't funny! It is when it happens to someone you don't give a shit about. Hey, that's kind of like what I said to you a few moments ago. Yes, that's called irony. I have to get in there and stop Tsubaki. Quick, Yuki, think! What would Yuno do in this situation? <laughs> How the hell did you get in here? Wait, don't tell me. Your security suck! That joke's getting old. Here, Yuno, take my jacket. Shut up and let me be naked! Okay, that one was on purpose. Hey everyone, look at this! Ooh, pretty! Why do all my followers have ADD? Scissors beats paper. That's a dart. And you're dead! Why does every diary owner explode when they die? Is that going to happen to me? Don't worry, Yuki. I'll never let you explode. That's good. Unless it's inside of me! Uh... Hey, Yuki. 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 Yuki! What?! Your cheeks are soft. Okay, Mom, seriously, you're creeping me the f*** out. Oh, 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 it's his mom. And here I thought he was into cougars. It sure was nice of you to take me out to the movies, Yuki. It was either that, or spend the entire day putting up with Yuno and her inappropriate sex puns. Still. I wonder, I wonder what, what she's, she's doing, doing right now. I'm breaking and entering Yuki's house. And pretty soon, Yuki will be breaking and entering me. Uh-oh, Yuki. The back door's broken. Maybe a raccoon broke in. Yeah, a raccoon. A big pink-haired sex craze homicidal raccoon. What? You know, if you know what's good for you, you better not be reading my... Oh good, you're only reading my porn. But I swear to God, if you touch my dart book, I'll make you pay. Yuki, what's going on up there? Oh no, my mom's coming! Quick, Yuno, hide! Yuno! Can't hear you, Yuki. I'm playing with my hair. It's light pink, you know. Why must I suffer? This knob is almost as big as mine. Now what's all the noise in here? And why are you standing by the closet? Closet? What closet? This is a gateway to hell, and I'm trying to keep it shut so the demons don't get out. Hey, I'm not a demon! Did I just hear a girl's voice? Be gone, demon! Yuki, you're mean! There it is again. It came from the direction of the closet, but for some reason I'm looking out the window. Whatever you do, don't look over here! Over where? Over here! Here? Yes. You have broad shoulders. Bad touch, bad touch! Shut up and dance! And we You call that dancing? And just who might this be? Hello, ma'am. My name is Yuno Gasai, and I'm an exterminator. I don't remember calling for an exterminator. What are you here to exterminate? Your son's virginity. In that case, have at it. What? Yay! And in this photo, you can see that Yuki is naked and wet. I hope to make Yuki naked and wet. Nice. You two would burn, I'll be looking at... <laughs> oh good, you're only looking at my naked baby pictures. But remember what I said about the dart book! Can I have a copy of these to take home? How many copies would you like? How many you got? <laughs> this has been the most humiliating day of my life! I don't know how it could possibly get any worse. It's now time for everyone's favorite show, Sitting on the Can. I love this show. Hey, I'm trying to eat over here. And now I am naked. Because they shut up and let me be as such. You know, while you're in there, please take some time to admire our brand new faucet. Ooh, shiny. Nighty night. Sleep tight. Don't let the abstinence bite. Seriously, when I wake up tomorrow morning, that girl would better be pregnant with my grandchild. Get the fuck out of my room! Parental consent is...
Good. So, Yuki, wanna have sex? No. But why not? Your mom said we could. In case you haven't noticed, you know, my mom's not exactly the most responsible parent on Earth. Teenagers... Besides, I'm not attracted to in that way. But, Yuki, we have to have sex. The cell phone told me so. If the cell phone told you to commit murder... Well, who am I kidding? You'd do it even if it told you not to. But, Yuki... No, we're not doing it! But, Yuki... I have to think of a way to shut her up. Wait, I've got it. Hey, you know, look over there! A bag of knives! Ooh, shiny. Works every time. Yuki, come on out here. I've got something to show you. Meet your new baby brother. She said she'd give me a coloring book if I came with her. Okay, you know, I'll distract her, and then you take the kid and run to the nearest police station. I can still hear you, you know. <sighs> That's a nice drawing, Reisuke. I wonder who it could be. Ooh, 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 ooh. Fuck, I don't know. Why does this music sound so familiar? How the hell did you pull a pillow out of nowhere and block the attack at the last possible second? I'm you know fucking Kasai! That's how! Look at that side boo! When an assassination attempt fails, nothing cheers me up faster than taking a dump! We now return to sitting on the can! I love the show! Eating! Race We're going to have fun! Yes! Fun! Forever! Forever and ever. You're f***ing dead, bitch. Bring it on, Carrot Top. Oh, you can- My hair tickles my butt. I've got you now, big sister. You're completely exposed. But not as exposed as these wires I'm holding. Because just like all five-year-olds, I know that water conducts electricity and wearing rubber gloves prevents me from getting shocked. Mom, what are you doing? I'm sticking my erotic PC game into the microwave. Um, why? Because it wasn't hot enough. I want to make it even hotter. That sounds like a really bad idea. What could possibly go wrong? Die! My bad. Damn it! You know, are you alright? Drink it! Yuki? As long as you're here, let's have sex! Now's not the time! It's never the time! Okay, with the knife, maybe I can kill him with the power of enlightenment! Learn you must to control your insanity, or else die you will, and have sex with your boyfriend you will not. Kermit the Frog is right! I gotta do something! You know, what are you doing in here? Yuki, we don't have a lot of time. And there's something I need you to do for me. What is it? Pull down my pants and do me in the ass. Now's not the time. It's never the time. Yuki, why are you vomiting? Could it be that you're pregnant? <laughs> Stop smelling my underwear. Never. Let's get you to join me, big sister. I hope you're wearing rubber. You hope I'm wearing a rubber? Baby! This can't be happening! How could I be losing to a little kid? I don't understand! That is why you failed. Shut up, Kermit the Frog! I'm bored. Oh, if only Yuki would come and kiss me. Then my strength would be miraculously restored. <laughs> no, wait. What I meant to say is, if only Yuki would have sex with me. Now's not the time! It's never the time! Ouch. I just electrocuted you! And not only did you survive, you're not even injured! How is that possible? You know... <laughs> Gasai. Damn, this hurts. Big sister, would you please inject me with this morphine to reduce my pain? Well? 
Yeah, I knew you wouldn't help me. Because just like all five-year-olds, I know that you, you know Gaston, are the world's biggest cu- Uh-oh. Love you! Okay, Yuki. It's only a classroom. Nothing to be scared of. Just make your way to your desk without drawing any attention to yourself. That could have gone better. You see this band-aid on my face? Yeah. Wanna know how I got it? Uh, bear wrestling. Bear wrestling. Bear wrestling. You were wrestling naked, and you didn't invite me. I said bear, not bear. Were you at least bear when you bought the bear? Mo, I swear to God, I will break you. Okay. Not like that. Sure has gotten gay in here all of a sudden. Gary, what did that guy just say? I wasn't listening, Dave. I was too busy enjoying your bicep. Here, let me help you up. <laughs> <laughs> Well, sure help me up, if you know what I mean. Later. Hey, Yuki! Huh? Friendship. Friendship. I have a knife. Why aren't I using it? You hear that, you know? Hina just said that she's my friend! Do you know what this means? Yep. You know! I didn't do it! You expect me to believe that Hinata was killed and you had nothing to do with it? I know. I'm scared, too. I will always remember Hinata as the best friend I have ever had. And I will always remember her ass as the hottest ass I've ever seen. Asses to asses and dust to dust. Have you ever been touched by an angel? Um, no. Well, you have now. Ha, I get it. Look at my meat. What? What? Does it look appetizing enough to distract a pack of dogs? Uh, I guess? Wonderful. <laughs> Have those dogs been there this whole time? Yes. Why didn't I notice them before? Because you were too busy staring at my bone. But you're not holding a bone. That doesn't mean I don't have one. What? Nothing. Somebody amongst us is the killer. <laughs> the question is, who? It's her. Him. Yeah. No, it's you. Hmm. No, it's him. Hey, you did me already. And besides, how do we know it's not you? Because if it was me, we wouldn't be having this conversation. Well, maybe it was Yuki. Not a chance. Why not? Uh... Because he's just too sexy. No argument here. What? Nobody's f***ing Yuki's mind but me. Actually, nobody's f***ing Yuki at all but me. We'll see about that. What? Well, it looks like everything is finally back to normal. <laughs> Ironically, this qualifies as normal for me now. Nobody move, or the boy gets it! You know, for the love of God, stand still! I have a knife. Why aren't I using it? Mo, why did you do it? Why did you kill Hinata? I've got my reasons. What are they? None of your damn business! She has no reasons! What? Because Mao isn't the killer! She isn't? I isn't? No! Damn it! How did you know that I was just faking my death the entire time? I didn't. I never implied that I did. Then how did you know that Mao wasn't the killer? Honestly, I didn't. I was just speculating. Oh. Uh... I have returned from beyond the grave to seek my revenge! Too late! Whoa, whoa, with rap, 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 being a dog, eating dinner out of a can. Oh, please take me to a restaurant to have a steak just like a man. I'd have to kill her and... On second thought, Yuki, you're right. She is your friend. <laughs> now, if you'll excuse me, I have to go take care of something. Meanwhile... Yeah. 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 Uh-huh. Oh, really? <laughs> All right, Hinata, time for you to die. Do you mind? I'm on the phone! Oh, sorry. Uh-huh. Yeah. Mm-hmm. 
Yep. Okay, bye. Who are you talking to? No f***ing idea. But they sounded drunk. Ah. Oh. Back to killing! No! Well, it looks like everything worked out just fine. Hinata has a new friend, you have a boyfriend, Mao's going to make a full recovery, and best of all, nobody had to die tonight. Except for that dog I killed earlier. Why did you do that? Because it tried to hump Yuki's leg! Okay. Wait. Why does the guy that you hate more than anybody else in the world have your cell phone number? I hate you more than anybody else in the world! Duly noted. May I please have your cell phone number? Sure. That bastard tricked me! No, he didn't. And now we return to the present timeline. This has been one hell of a day. <laughs> Asai is suffering from amnesia! Because she isn't trying to kill you? No, because you had previously mentioned her big gaping hole, and she didn't reciprocate with one of her inappropriate sex puns. You three! <laughs> F off! Uh. Now I just need to get rid of these two idiots, and then I can go save Yuki! And so then I said, peripheral vision? What's that? <laughs> <laughs> That's hilarious! Uh, yeah. Anyway, I gotta go take a piss. Keep an eye on the dead-eyed girl clutching the fire extinguisher until I get back, would ya? Sure thing! Make sure she doesn't try and sneak up behind me, hit me over the head with the fire extinguisher, and steal my gun. That'd be pretty stupid and embarrassing. Don't worry, Steve. I won't let anything happen to you! That guy just gave me a great idea! Trade you this for your firearms! You've got yourself a deal! Sucker! I would have traded these for a pack of bubblegum!